In this video, we address troubleshooting commonly encountered problems with the endoscope. We start with an introduction to the endoscope, then we start to talk and teach about problems with lighting, insufflation, problems with suctioning, problems with the irrigation, problems that you might have with the monitor, and problems you might have with forceps. Throughout the video, we refer to an interactive cutaway diagram of the endoscope, which shows its inner workings. We also use through the scope footage when necessary to demonstrate particular issues that you might have with the lens or with the lighting. We talk extensively about the suction biopsy channel as this is where most problems occur during an endoscopy. We talk about the wall suction, troubleshooting those issues, and basic tasks including forward flushing or brushing the endoscope and we talk about the more advanced tasks, including back flushing the endoscope and exactly how that happens and what is being accomplished. We talk about the various subcomponents of the endoscope, including the water pump, the water jet channel, troubleshooting those issues that may occur. We talk about the light source and processor. We talk about how the scope is connected and problems that might occur with the later model as well as newer model endoscopes. We talk about the monitor and its various connections. We also address air insufflation and CO2 insufflation as well as problems that might occur with the air water channel. We hope after viewing this video that new trainees, nurses, and technicians will have a better idea of how the endoscope works and that this will increase teamwork in the endoscopy suite.